Hey loves, I hope you are all doing well today. If you are new here, then welcome love. My name is Shawnee and if you are a returning subscriber, then love, you already know what the deal is. Go ahead, if you are new here and hit that subscribe button, share and like this video. As you can see, me and hubby just got done working out. And so we are prepping lunch early in the day, so we do not have to worry about it later. Um, I do film mostly on the weekend, so this is, I love this time. Um, this is a very natural moment for us. And so we just love um, being in the kitchen together and cooking. And so go ahead, grab a snack, kick back, and I hope you enjoy the rest of this video. Scratch. Yeah, you so cheap, but you doing your own boomerang, babe. Chef shivers. <laughs> Did you say I'm cheap? But you doing your own boomerang, babe. I'm doing my own boomerang. Mm -hmm. Trust me. It's a lot of vid videographers that do their own thing. They just make it look good when they edit. Okay. Who you calling? Some backup? Cause you need it today. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to be putting this up in my son's closet. It's the Rubbermaid Home Free Series. And I absolutely love these things because they maximize the space in very small spaces. And so I'm gonna show you, this is what his closet looks like right now. It is not a very big closet as you can see. And so I'm going to actually put it on this wall right here. <clears throat> um, this is where I'm going to place it. And then this is going to give me so much more space to put books and clothes and just everything. And we can see all of their school supplies and they're just easily accessible. And so I'm going to go ahead and get started on that. So what I am doing right here is I am marking the wall and making my placements. And then I also love to pre-drill when possible because this just makes for an easy um, lay attachment when you are attaching anything to any kind of wall. Uh, so this is what I'm doing here. And my son is just so fascinated by this drill. <laughs> I can't lie, so am I. <laughs> I very rarely get to use it. Uh, my husband usually does all of these types of things, but today I wanted to do them. And so, and I thoroughly enjoyed it. So <laughs> yes, definitely mark the wall and pre-drill uh, before you start putting the attachments on there. So I would be curious to know where you think you would be able to utilize a unit like this. The best part about this is that it has so many different arrangements and so it'll fit whatever kind of style that you're needing it to. For me, I just absolutely wanted to maximize the storage and also you'll see later in the video 
that you can also hang clothes on these things. So it is amazing. You can pick this up at Lowe's, Home Depot, or order it online at Amazon, of course. All right. So as you can see, this is a really simple foundation setup. It's just a matter of placing this bar and then these are just gonna hang just like this. And then you see they have these little hooks right here. So that way you don't have to worry about it slipping. But once you find the studs, which I was able to do um, with this little gadget right here, it just kind of helps you find where the studs are, which is really nice. Um, and so once you do that, then it's just a matter of placing all of the little attachments where you want them so that you can create the height shelf that you need. So now I'm just adjusting the shelves in just different arrangements to see which one I like better. Um, and so like I said, y'all, super easy to install and it is so affordable and it has definitely maximized the space in this closet. I will also place a link below, a link probably to Amazon. Um, this is where I have discovered that they have so many more units that you could utilize like this. So if I could find the link um, to a very similar closet unit, then I absolutely will link that below. So just be looking for that. I actually got these from Walmart. I've also seen them at Target. And what they are is they're little storage bins. I love using these for books because you'll find these in classrooms and you can use them for anything. I love organizing the kids books with these, papers, binders, anything that we utilize at home a lot. I love using these. And as you can see, I actually found some little labels at Target and see I put fiction on there and then I just kind of put some tape, some clear tape around it just to kind of make sure that it was on there but this way the kids can grab whatever it is that they're needing and it's easy to put back. So yes, love these bins.
thank you so much for joining me today. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And for more motivation, go ahead and click on part one of this fall closet deep clean and organize with me. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye, loves. Bye, <laughs> back now, mommy. Yes, baby. Bye, buddy. Thanks for coming. And hey, you want to be here? Spread it, spread it. Bye, love.